All over the world, there have been discoveries of incredible megalithic structures that continue to puzzle engineers and archaeologists in the modern era. Not only are these structures impossible to replicate in current times, but they are seen as monumental and impossible tasks, especially considering many of these were created thousands of years ago. How they built these structures is widely unknown and has caused much speculation. One of these mysterious sites can be found in Russia. When first looking at the structures, one thing comes to mind and that's their size. Located in the Vutuvara mountains are strange boulders that seem to have been shaped by an unknown force. Although some say they are just weathered, others suggest that an ancient civilization used to live in the area. The locals call these structures cedar, and believe the land they're found on is sacred. They believe the spirit of locals inhabit these areas, and that during some nights you can actually see them moving around close to the boulders. Not only this, but there are some that think a giant civilization used to live in the area, and the reason behind their designs is because they were carved. Over the years, many people have questioned the designs of the boulders. After these stories were released, this area became a popular tourist attraction. So my question to you guys is how do you think these boulders were formed? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Another mysterious monument that's shrouded in mystery is the Yonaguni Monument in Japan. It was originally believed by ancient Japanese scriptures and legends that there was an undiscovered Yonaguni city located near the shores of the Yonaguni Islands. Unfortunately for archaeologists and historical experts, nothing had ever been recovered. It was due to this that many experts widely regarded these myths and legends as similar to that of a Japanese Atlantis, and believed the city to be just a story. Back in 1986, divers in the region discovered striking underwater rock formations. It appeared by researchers to have been artificial in creation, due to the sharp edges, 90 degree angles and massive megalithic pillars in the region. Unfortunately, despite this proof as well as the work done by a professor of seismology, the Japanese government and academics refused to believe that any structure existed, and attributed them to being naturally formed rock formations in the water. It's impossible for divers to visit the region in recent years, as the location has been deemed unsafe by Japanese officials, and no further research can be established. Many believe the monument is being hidden, and the efforts to study it have been stopped. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.